Hey guys, welcome back to another Pokemon Master video. So today, uh, we're gonna talk about some event-related stuff, but before that, of course, daily discount, because it's a daily discount. <laughs> I don't know why I have to, like, justify a daily discount every time I do a video. Like, come on, it's a daily discount. I'm summoning on it. It's, what, 200? Oh! What we get in here. It is a uh, Drake. I'll take that. It's a Drake dupe. Um, not the most exciting uh, dupe to get. Uh, Drake's not bad, but it's, you know, I'd just rather get something new instead of a uh, dupe. I do have a few four stars that I, st I still need, though. Um, actually, one second. I need to turn off the volume here. Anyways, uh, we're back. I just forgot to turn on the game time. I keep on forgetting to turn it on. So, anyways. Um, today we're going to talk about some of this event stuff, so apparently, if you guys haven't noticed already, they actually added a bunch of coins into the event exchange, so yeah, this is a lot of coins, like this is how much, um, 10, 100, 10,000 coins um, for 100 of these vouchers, I, I think it's the same for every event, every event probably has one now, um, yep. Uh, that's a hundred a hundred. Yeah, so all these have these um, Vouchers that you can exchange for coins. That's great. That's a lot of coins like and it's really helpful because Evolution items are extremely expensive in this game. It's like 900k or something um, to 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 get a, a, a second stage evolution um, for the uh, evolution crystal so those take a lot of money slash coins so uh, and and there weren't any other consistent methods of getting coins other than just doing the uh, the coin super course and also just regular levels. But you know, it takes forever to grind coins on regular levels. But uh, other than that, the coin super course. I personally don't have too much troubles with coins just because I just play this game so much uh, on a regular basis. But you know, a lot of people have been telling me they've been having issues with coins. So now they added this uh, this new coin exchange in the shop, which is. You know, which would help a lot with that. I have a lot of exchanges here. So, uh, what you could do here um, for for those who need coins, also need gym leader notes, and might need some of these the golden Gatorade, the golden level cap items. Uh, 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 you know, I, I just found a really really great way is just to go ahead and do um, these these events. And and the best one, honestly, is just Blue's event, just because. Uh, in comparison, blue, blue the um, you know, blue is hard, and then the other two are very hard. And um, Blaine, I find it like really hard to actually auto. Um, and blue and grass type training event is actually really easy to auto. On the other hand, uh, on the other hand, so you know, uh, of these, blue is actually probably the easiest one to take out just because it's hard, and um, you know, even quick connect, it's incredibly easy to take down like it usually just takes one one Pokemon and you can just auto it like I usually you know if you have an Olivia it's like super easy like even if you don't have Olivia you know uh, Kranidos, Kranitar uh, though those could could still do decent against it as well so you know, there's that um, I'm just gonna put, put, put it on auto here and we should be good but yeah um, the reason why you probably would want to farm, farm this one is, again, uh, you want this coins, which, you know, coins are good, <laughs> right? And also, you probably want to complete the missions as well, like, there's missions that, that give you um, some other, you know, uh, items and stuff uh, that, it, you know, if you complete and think, I, I, I think one of them is actually completing, um, it, you'll have to, like, complete this event a number of times, so even if you already got all the stuff from the exchange, all the, the five-star power-ups and all that, for a blues event, uh, you probably would still want to run some more just to get those missions completed. There's, uh, there's, I think, uh, a mission for the, uh, the the hard version and then normal version as well. So like, I only completed the normal version one yesterday, just because like, honestly, like, or or not yesterday, like uh, two three days ago, just there really isn't any reason to run the normal uh, version when the uh, when the hard one actually uh, gives you. You know, gym leader notes and stuff, and now it gives you, you know, coins from vouchers. Although, yeah, you know, normal one gives you vouchers too, but hard just gives you slightly more. Uh, but you know, it's mainly for the chance to drop gym notes, uh, gym notes. But you know, um, other than that, there really wasn't uh, too much motivation for me to do the 
um, the, the thing anyways. So uh, what if I actually get destroyed here? <laughs> because I'm flinching right now and um, still on auto. <laughs> okay, we should be good now, maybe? Stone Edge, then we get a Unity soon, and maybe we won't get wrecked? I don't know. Got a Sync move up, so did these guys cue their moves before the Sync move? Because we could either get saved or get totally wrecked here. Um, okay, we're good, we're good, okay, yeah, we're good. Alright, so, uh, yeah, um, so just do hard runs, get the, get vouchers for coins if you need coins, also, decent chance to drop, drop, gym, uh, drop gym later notes, I think it's like 12% or something, uh, but yeah, the blue, blue one's the easiest, the other ones are, eh, whatever, um, the, the other ones are slightly harder, so, aside from that, um, if, if you guys still haven't gotten all the, uh, the stuff you want to exchange from the shops, you know, go ahead and do those as well. Like, the only really worth exchanging um, stuff is uh, the 5-star power-ups for Blue's event. And then the, I mean, honestly, the Grass and Rock training event, nothing really is <laughs> is worth it, really. Um, except for maybe uh, the coins and probably gym leader notes, if you really have trouble with those. Um, although, like, the amount of runs you need to actually get a uh, gym leader note from those... If you do the same amount of runs uh, in like a uh, very hard co-op, like a, or not very hard, a hard co-op, uh, main story co-op that drops gym, gym leader notes as well. Uh, oh, we got a gym leader note there. <laughs> uh, like, uh, or like an easy one, like a viola or something, you probably get, you know, one or two gym leader note drops in the same amount of runs as well. But then again, uh, that's guaranteed right over here. So, and you also get a chance to drop it anyways. So, uh, yeah, those are really the only things you probably want to exchange. The, uh, the the ticket thing, the 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 replay ticket, it lets you replay one of these quests that that have you know that have limited um, chances, right? The usually the super courses. Um, not really useful. Not it only lets you replay like an event once, which really isn't the biggest deal in the world. So unless like you're just you're just extremely just out of coins like you really really need coins and maybe spend one on a coin super course but like other than that like everything else you could just you know get from regular courses <laughs> so yeah that's not really worth grinding grinding at the moment but you know uh personally i just saved them up just in case in the future there's some better events that i could use them on but at the moment again nothing too special so uh, anyways that's me for uh this video i'm gonna go ahead and do my other two uh, daily discount summons as well. Uh, hopefully we get something uh, cool here. So, um, Olivia's banner. Uh, I'll take another Olivia. Like, my Olivia is already maxed out at five um, sync level. But, you know, if I get another one, that's another, that's a five-star power-up, <laughs> which I'll take. Um, oh, another antenna. <laughs> okay, let's see what we're getting here. Um, there's a few four stars I don't have. I would take Bruno or Agatha. That would, would be... Whitney was not on my, um, not very high on my priority list of um, four stars I would like to receive. But, you know, it's a four star regardless, and that levels up the sync move. Inches me closer to four star power ups, which would be cool. But, you know, four star power ups, they're miles away, honestly, just because of how terrible four star rates are, like, even compared to like five stars or some five stars. Like, uh, you know what? It depends on the banner, but in general, four stars are. Pretty terrible to pull pull for a specific four star. Okay, there we go. We got rocks on the last one. Four out of five there. Fortunately, didn't get any power ups today, but you know, we're 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 working on that. <laughs> Slowly getting there. So um, yeah, um, that's it for this one. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, let me know what you guys think about this uh, event revamp. This is kind of weird. Like they threw it in like in the middle of the event. It's like probably because they heard our feedback about like this you know these events they come out like grind like two hours and like it's done and there's like nothing else to do so maybe they just added some coins just for us to have something to grind for for the event right which is commendable but then again um if you don't need coins not the biggest deal in the world um like myself i don't really need coins so uh oh well <laughs> well anyways um again that's me for this one hope you guys enjoyed it subscribe to your channel for some more pokemon magic content and i'll see you guys in the next one